Boom. What up, Silver? And actually, only here back doing some more League of Legends action. We are playing some bah, Pantheon up in the top lane. Ooh, hit him already, baby. Let's go. I uh, play some Panth up in the top lane. The plan here is to go for a ton of attack speed so that we can have our uh, E shield up all the time. Mainly just that we can have our uh, four stack up. Oh, we're getting spicy, huh? I got the flash. Bro, he hurts, man. What the hell? What is his name? Renekton? Never heard of him. I'm actually surprised I lose level 1 against him with a Doran shield. But hey, what you gonna do? Mmm. Big W here. I thought he was gonna flash, uh, by the way. That's why I flashed. I could have just kept walking. But I can't flash late. I mean, if I'm him, I'm flashing there and queuing. That's why I did it. But yeah, plan here is to get a bunch of attack speed and then have our E up like all the time. Uh, he's roaming on mid lane. Okay. As long as my mid lane doesn't die, we can only ping 300 times. Wish him luck. Nice. Yeah, as long as he doesn't die right there, that's really good for us. Uh, although this is going to be annoying. See, the problem here is my wave's slow pushing out, so I kind of have to just let them do their own thing. I think I can shove. I just can't rotate down there, because what happens if I rotate down there? Nice. Great job. If I rotate down there, I end up getting screwed on the wave, and then he comes back to a giant wave at his tower. So that's why it's good for him to roam there, but he ended up making a mistake and didn't really find the play that he needed to find. Cool. So we can just shove this wave in, deny a bunch of farm to tower. Sweet. Very good. Noise. Can I finish this one? Should be able to. Hi ya. Okay. Time to go back to base, get some long swords. Sweet. Uh, gonna go blade first. Or sanguine blade. I'm not sure. Blade of the Rune King or Sanguine Blade. Those are gonna be our two items. Well, they're going to give us a ton of attack speed. And they're obviously on hit effects as well. And that should allow us to auto like crazy. So the whole premise is we want to just keep cycling. Because there's five hits until you get an empowered ability. So there's Q, which is the uh, stab or the hold it and then it's the throw. Stab is generally better, of course, for like lane trades because you get half the cooldown back. Whereas if you throw it long distance, you don't. And then also there's no damage fall off through units. If you're just using the, the thrust, the quick uh, tap. And then W is a stun, E is a blocking damage in front of you, so whatever direction that you aim the E. And then they all get empowered when you have 5 stacks. And you get a stack every time you hit an ability, or auto attack. Or if you empower W, you get 3 stacks. So W is like triple auto attack with 3 stacks, and it would apply on hits each time. So when we have Blade of the Rune King, we'll play three Blade of the Rune King procs. Kind of similar to like Renekton and W. Uh, Empowered Q does more damage. That's annoying. Okay. Interesting gank there, boys. Try again next time. Gotcha, bitch. Alright, noise. Try and shove this in. Look to reset. Easy peasy. So that was the uh, empowered W stun. So we stun him with the W, and then we get three uh, fast autos. And those three fast autos build three stacks. Those three stacks get us to our next empowered ability, which was our empowered Q. And then Q also does bonus damage when a target's below 20% HP. So below 20% HP, the thing does 315 plus 53. And then if it's empowered, it does another 100 and. 12 quick math i think <laughs> all right i'm gonna get sanguine blade first i think this game i could look to roam somewhere with my ult up could be bot lane that'd be a decent roam see if i can get down there i believe you get uh yeah instantly ready is mortal will that's what i was thinking i was gonna say want to make sure we get like all the way behind oh okay that's really good are they gonna go forward oh that's so good 
They might even die before I even get there. Use E to block the tower shots as we go out. Beautiful. Sweet. And then your E is a, when it's five stack, it's a 2.5 second damage reduction instead of a 1.5 second. It also does damage as well, but the main reason why we're getting it is obviously the damage reduction, or using it as the damage reduction, which, as you just saw, works on towers as well. Ooh, I'm coming here. I don't know if you can catch him. He's gonna go for this. No. Good try. Alright, back to the top we go. So yeah, just trying to cycle as many autos as we can just to get to the five stack. We also have Halo Blades too. So when we jump in, we get the triple hit and then we can auto... Wow, that was really annoying. I should have queued earlier, I guess. I don't know if I would have killed it though. Hmm. That was kind of annoying. Minions damage and the tower hit at the same time. Bursted. Alright, begin a minion. Ooh. Kind of bait him into using stun. I'll take it. Free poke. Power potion here. Really good trade right there. Ideally what we get is our E against his W. He tries to stun us, we press our E. Block the damage from it. It's a really good trade. I think he just has to like leave though. Alright, shove this in. Let's look for a play. Get a plate. Grab this. Noise. Oh. You can also tap it uh, E again to end. It also does damage in front of you when it ends. Oh, my man, I chunk you. Careful. Ooh. Okay. Looking for the play. Don't find it. It's all good. Walk away. Wait for another opportunity. Ooh. I don't have ult up yet, buddy. This guy's definitely roaming down there. I'm gonna move, but... I think that guy dies. Oh, I'm here, I'm here, I'm here. Pretty close. Nice, no, gonna live. Unless. What up? Alright. Never mind. Never mind. <laughs> I can't believe he played that shit so safe. Look how far away he was. Oof. I don't want to fight this guy. I can't believe he played that so safe. You big baby. I was for sure thinking he was going to be under that tower. <laughs> I mean, you can ping all you want, bro. Like, I'm still going to stand here. Thanks, dude. Because now we do this. See? Chunked him out. Just for you. I'm going to reset. Just a leap onto him, auto attack, Q him, and then as he's returning damage, we just E and disengage. Alright, let's get another one of these as well. Get some manas back. Run back to top lane. Pretty good, pretty good. Uh-oh. Oh, I missed knockup. He's dead. Maybe the kill? Absolutely not. What? Okay. Not the best. Alright, he's going Black Leaper first. Interesting. Sweet. Let's clear out this wave. Oof. I didn't want to use my Q. I guess it doesn't matter because I have so much attack speed. I'm just going to... Well, not yet, but I will have so much attack speed that I can just build up the 5 stack again, like, instantly. Alright, cool. Get a ward down. We're heading CS. We have two dragons. I'm heading kills. I don't have ult up, so I can't make a play in mid. I'm going to ward to make sure I'm a little bit safe here. 
Gonna clear out this wave quickly. Maybe look to roam after? Not really. A little poke. Can I find the Q on him here? He's definitely gonna walk up for this, right? E block it. Disengage. Sweet! I'm gonna get in this bush. See if I can find a play on him. My jungle is going for objectives, I like it. Ooh, that would've been nice. Disengage, you got another dash, Q him. I think we just all in. Uh, okay. I was gonna all in him there, but if he ults, I can just walk away. Oh boy. Got him. Oh, I didn't get the kill. I have stun here. We'll take that. No! I'm not wasting my time. <laughs> it takes too long to kill that thing. For us two. I'd rather just shove this wave. Alright, cool. Yeah. Shove this in. Might get plates. He's dead for 8 seconds still. Alright, this could rotate on me though. Might get plates. Gonna try. Got one. Walk away. Throw out the rest of this wave real fast. Sweet. Looks like Rise down in the bot lanes. I'm gonna keep pushing. I got enough gold for my item. Let's bail. Oh, thought he was gonna go a little bit more aggressive. It's all right. Back, grab this, get another long sword. Maybe ult back to lane or down here, probably to lane. Oh, Yasuo, 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 oh. Uh-oh. Needs wind wall or he's, or he's dead. Oh, baby. Yeah. Good try, dude. I really wish I was level 11 before I use my ult here. We're trying to see where they go back. If they go to mid lane, I can run there and ult. Oh, I'm coming. I mean, I'm here. It just it depends. I don't know if I kill him straight up. Probably better just to kill these people in bot lane. I don't know if I can do it all by myself. Oh, now I can. He's by himself. <laughs> Got it. We take that. <laughs> Dude, the Q itself did 400 damage. I was like, wait a second, she's real low and that's Yumi. That's not a real champion. <laughs> yeah, if you can get on this guy. Oh, no. Oh? Yo, knock him up, bro. Where was the Q? Oof. I think it's because he just used it and he couldn't use it again. Damn. Bruh. That play is terrible. Oh my goodness. This guy's MIA too. He could be rotating down. Oh baby, the attack speed is so good. I love it. I can't wait for team fights. We're gonna like permanently have uh, empowered abilities up. And we can use those to like, I can literally have my E up like the whole time. Either be stunning them or using my E to block. In a 1v1, like, how do you even trade against me? You're either stunned or I'm blocking. Every time you try and hit me. I right, keep pushing this wave in. Auto for the empowered hit. Beautiful. Get wave here. Or tower. You can look for all Team is doing well. Okay. Okay, go team. Go team. I see you. Noise. Shove this wave in. Get all this farm. Noise. Uh, they're gonna go for dragon. I'm just gonna keep pushing. I don't have ultimate yet. Really just wanna keep pushing, try and get as much gold as I can. Get my blade as fast as possible. Blade's gonna give me the triple double hit. The triple hit on W. English hard. Alright, we leave right here. Hmm. Hot potion. Try and run this way. I think I'm okay. Goodbye. Oh, he dashed over the wall. Well, you, de you definitely can't get me now. 
Like that was your dash. <laughs> like what? Steal it, steal it, steal it. Bop! What cannon? I didn't see a cannon. The one I took, what do you mean? No. Oh boy. Oh boy. I'm here to defend. Uh, they're gonna get top wave, unfortunately. Two point five second block, baby. No damage. Boop. Hit him with a Q. I vault soon. Uh, okay. Free ward apparently. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, I'm gonna go top. And clear out that wave. Unfortunately, I had to stay mid, and I couldn't. I was gonna go top earlier on the wave. Well, wave and a half earlier, like forty-five seconds earlier. But it's okay. No problemo. Oh, I'm gonna try and get here. Nah, he doesn't walk here. It's fine. If he walked into that bush, I would have a nice play, I think. Although I do have a ton of gold. Might be better just to chill. Farm up my uh, completed items just so another wave and then go back by, spend it. Find a play on the map. Mainly with my ultimate. Oh wow. Reset. Sweet. Let's go, baby. Got enough gold. Just gotta dance a little bit first. Beautiful. Look at the moves. Uh oh. Yumi rise, baby. That's scary. That is scary. I have my ultimate available. Definitely gonna ult in on this. Party time! Woo, baby! We take it. We take those. Bro, what's the attack speed looking like? I love it. I mean, with Halo Blades, it's obviously insane. Even right now, though, 1.4. It's pretty good. Shut this in. The Crocodile Man's just chilling up in the top lane. I don't think this is the worthwhile trade, my friend. If Yumi walks close enough, I'll try and stun, uh, stun her. I really think I could just kill this guy. Uh, maybe not two of them. Catch that. Okay, Yumi healed once. <laughs> Never mind. Uh... Yeah, come, come, come. Yeah, I think we can do it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, baby. That hurts. Oh, wow. I mean, I think they both die. <laughs> Holy shit, dude. Rise is a ridiculous champion. Rise Yumi OP. Bro, he's like melting me through my E. Oh my god. <laughs> that was so much damage. I know I'm super squishy because of the build I have at the moment, but oh my god. We need a wit's end. Big brain. Big brain wit's end. That's the that's the build. Oh hold up, are we just gonna end it right here? I legit think we can end because we have Shelly. Yeah, Shelly like one hits towers. Ooh, baby. Yeah, I go wit's end here. That'd be pretty decent. Noise! Bro, I got blown up right there. Now, I, I should have used my empowered E. I used it on Q, so I only had the short duration uh, E. So I got stuck. Look at Shelly dancing. Look at the moves. Shelly, Shelly. She got moves. Shelly's like, uh, uh, uh. Um, let me give it to this guy. He played pretty well. Made some interesting plays, but he played pretty well overall. I like it. Pretty good build, baby. Pretty good. A lot of damage. The Hail Blades actually did a lot better. Someone suggested it in chat. Did a lot better than I thought. 
The only reason I thought it was going to be that great is because when you W, like when you use your Empower W, uh, you get three fast auto attacks. And those are like, they're not counted for the Halo Blades. So you can do those three fast auto attacks and then you can do three more fast auto attacks. So it's actually a lot of damage. And then if you add in something like this, that's six auto attacks that are doing 12% of my opponent's current HP. Like that's a lot of damage. We could honestly follow this up with a more defensive build. I mean, I was going to go defensive. Like I think Wits End and Merc Dreads are like a defensive build. But yeah, I got to sneeze. Now we're good. <coughs> Excuse me. Goddamn. But yeah, anyways, pretty good game overall. Zen Zhao putting out some damage. Pretty good, man. Pretty good. Yeah, I think you should just get Blade first. If you got Blade, you would have had better better trades against me. Punks are... Uh, Black Cleaver is fine, but I just think Blade's so much better. Either way, maybe I could have went Blade first too. Blade with, with the uh, W, Empowered W, might have been better than Rushing Sanguine Blade. I don't know, Sanguine felt pretty decent as well. The amount of attack speed that we get in the side lane. I guess it scales with level, the uh, Sanguine Blade does. So it might actually be better to get a second. Same reason why you generally get Wits End second on champions and not first. Because they don't start to scale too much. Like when you... Like they scale with levels. So if you're getting them earlier in the game, they're less powerful than if you get them a little bit later. But yeah, anyways, GG well played. Hope you guys enjoyed that one. If you're watching over on YouTube, make sure to like the video, subscribe for more content like this. If you're watching over on the live stream, make sure to follow the live stream. My stream every single day, 6 a.m. to 12 noon EST. Follow and be alerted when I go live. GG well played. Thanks for watching. Make sure to tune in next time. And I'll catch you guys then. Peace.